You guys, I haven't had a new desk in over five years. And the desk that I was using, well... But when FlexiSpot gave me an opportunity to give an honest review on one of their desks, I couldn't say no. But the big question here is, how does it benefit you guys? So, without any further delay, my name is David with Side of Tech. Let's go ahead and check it out. FlexiSpot really makes unboxing and assembly really easy, but my biggest tip is to have a second person with you to help you lift the desk. The tabletop and the legs are really heavy, so you either have to be hitting that gym or assembly is just going to take you a little bit longer. Another recommendation I can give is try investing in some casters. This is something that I really wish I got before I assembled everything. You can buy them directly from FlexiSpot or just look some up on Amazon, but just make sure they'll fit. Now as far as the actual assembly goes, you basically have to lay down the table top, screw down the frame, assemble the legs, screw down the power boxes, and the standing controls. And by the way, this is a good time to secure any under the desk accessories, like your cable management or any drawers. After flipping everything over, all in all, this took me roughly around 30 minutes, and give or take another hour or so to put everything back on the desk. After doing all that, this is what we came out with. Let's go ahead and move on to the configuration. I have here the solid wood texture in black walnut and it's 72 by 30 inches. I really have to say flipping this thing over and putting all the accessories on top, the tabletop is beautiful. The black walnut really is an amazing color. Also opting for 72 inches gives me the perfect size to fit everything on top of the desk. As far as the frame goes, I went with the inverted stage three. This gives me 287 pounds of weight capacity. I can technically sit on top of the desk, but with all this gear, I'm really not willing to risk it all. You can also go as low as 24.4 inches and as high as 50 inches. That's a huge range for me to sit and stand. The motor also runs really smooth and is basically silent, especially when compared to my last desk, which was always noisy. <laughs> Now I do understand I have a whole bunch of gear on top of my desk, easily over 100 pounds of weight. The dual motor system that FlexiSpot has can handle it like a champ. I will say under this weight, the desk does struggle to climb up at a faster speed. That's not really annoying to me, but I know for some people it might bug them. Also the wobbling has been pretty good as well. Placing my arms on top of the tabletop, I only see a slight wobble in my monitor. This is more due to the fact that my monitor arm isn't as stable and I also have a 30 pound ultra wide monitor. But as far as rocking the desk back and forth, I don't really see it tipping over or any of my gear for that matter. The desk also comes with the advanced keypad, which is pretty standard, but the cool thing is that it lights up whenever you use it. I found this pretty nifty getting into my emo mood and working in the dark. You can set preset heights and also set timed reminders to stand, which is an awesome feature just to remind you to stand up and to not sit all day. Now the feature that I can give all the praises to is the anti-collision system. It's a very welcome feature that wasn't available on my previous desk. And let's just say within five years, there's definitely been some close calls. And fun fact, when I was testing the sit and stand capabilities, I accidentally left my desk chair underneath a table. It gave me a little heart attack, but I was glad to see firsthand that the anti-collision system is really good. And for added peace of mind, I wanted to test it one more time just to see that it wasn't a fluke. And I'm very happy to say that the system worked again. I don't know if this feature is common amongst all other standing desks, but I really feel this should just be standard like it is with the flexi spot desk so safe to say i'm really satisfied with the e5 desk so with all these features and settings you would think it would cost you well over a thousand dollars but no way the desk at its retail price is 854 dollars and 99 cents but the thing is flexi spot always runs sales on their website so at the time of this recording you can get this setup for 654 dollars and 99 cents that's 200 dollars in savings i know myself how hard it is for some people to afford these types of products but it's really good to know that there are companies out there that can make really great products at an amazing price next i want to go over some of the accessories that flexispot offers on their website just so you guys can get an idea of what they offer
So for the desk accessories, I went ahead and opted in for the cable tray, the under the desk drawer, the bamboo monitor stand, and the on the desk outlet and charger. First, let's go ahead and talk about the cable tray. I must say that the quality was really nice. It's made of a really nice metal and you could tell it's going to last long underneath your desk. The only thing is I have so many cables that I really do need a longer cable management system. If FlexiSpot were to make this a little bit longer, I think this would really work out well. So for now, I'm sticking this on the side of my PC to catch any of the loose cables. I think this is a perfect spot for it. Next, let's go ahead and talk about the under the desk drawer. The drawer is really solid. It's also made from the same metal as the cable tray and it also comes out fairly easy. On my older desk, I used to have a desk drawer that kept scratching me constantly. This one's really smooth all the way around and I could tell it's not going to scratch. The one thing is that I wish that the drawer could come out a little bit further. It only comes out about 5 inches when I know that it's much bigger than that. But it keeps all the clutter off of my desk and I guess that's really all that matters. Just a quick tip, if you have a journal that you're keeping inside the drawer, make sure to angle it. That way it can fit and you won't have any other problems. So I'm really a walnut guy, but I've always wanted to try bamboo accessories on my desk. The color of it also matches my workstation, so I think it's the perfect fit. The bamboo monitor stand that FlexiSpot offers is really nice and sturdy. I also really like the grip of the feet as opposed to my Grove made one that slides around due to not having any rubber feet. Also, I like to use desk shelves to house all my desk accessories, but I can tell that the bamboo is so much more solid than the walnut desk shelf that I have. Safe to say, I really do like the look of this shelf and I love the quality. So I think it's going to live on my desk for a little while longer. And lastly, I want to talk about the charger that I have on my desk. I love that it just fits perfectly and that I'm able to see what I'm charging. It has USB-C, USB-A, and three outlets where I like to plug in my camera chargers. It also just sits at a perfect level where you can plug in a bunch of different size chargers and plugs. This is by far my favorite desk accessory that FlexiSpot offers and it really fits my needs well. Now the accessories that I got here today is just scratching the surface from what they offer. I'm scrolling down the website page and it literally doesn't stop. I think it's safe to say if you're looking for some desk accessories to add some utility to your desk, there won't be a shortage here. And for my recommendation, I think FlexiSpot is a great place for those who are looking for their first standing desk. If you decide to go with a more expensive company, you're going to be paying for that for sure. But for a first timer, this is a perfect desk for you guys. It's going to give you everything that you need and you're going to completely forget about it and be able to focus on all the activities that you need to do on your desk. So if we go over my ratings, buy a full price, try it out, wait for a sale or completely pass on this product. So my overall rating for the FlexiSpot E5 desk, I'm going to go ahead and recommend to you guys to try it out. Especially if you're a first timer looking for their first standing desk, I definitely recommend the E5. So what did you guys think about that desk review? If you guys are interested in joining a tech community that's up and coming here on YouTube, definitely hit that subscribe button down below. Check me out over at my Instagram at side of tech. Over there I post some reels, photos, and a whole bunch of behind the scenes that I'm working on on this channel. But with all that being said you guys, this is David serving you a little side of tech and I'll see you in the next video. God bless you guys.